Yeah. Um, yeah, first I want to talk about National EU. I don't think some people really understand the full meaning a national hero. A national hero, I think, is supposed to be somebody who done a lot for the country, respectable in the federation, and again, it doesn't have to be a politician. It could be a footballer who really done a lot. It could be a cricketer. It could be somebody in the community. You know, but the problem I have with the national hero, and I. I hear some people say give people the flowers when they're alive. That is a true saying. It's all depends on what you're dealing with and how you're dealing with that. Because when I sit down, I like to analyze before I say anything. And if a lot of people realize, me don't want to stop. Some people don't like to listen, but and that's why they make me argument. As a people call it, I like to argue. But if I realize there's a valid point. Because let's let's look at I never ever think of it that way that we should never have a living national hero. And Simmons get it? As I say, okay. I think it was a good thing. He's alive. And give him what belongs to him. But in a nutshell, when you analyze Simmons getting a national hero and alive, you realize the mess we end up in in this country with Simmons as the national hero alive. And why I said it. You clearly see the intention of giving Simmons national hero was a show. I'm not saying that he don't deserve it. Don't get me wrong. He can see the independence based on the situation he independence and the stories. But that is beside the point. If it's independence, so okay. The problem I have now is that you could clearly see that Timothy Harris and these guys was not genuine. Let's look at Simmons getting the national hero. Was it real? Was it a shock? And why I say this? People could recall some years ago. Joshua, Lord the radio, please. People could recall some years ago that when Simmons got the national hero, Everybody jump up. Okay. You remember Pam had a convention? And at that convention, Tim Simmons get up in the convention and launch an attack on labor. Just, recall, just follow me, people. Just follow me while you're making this point. Launch an attack on labor at the Pam convention. I think it was in Sandy Point or somewhere. And I said like this, our national hero should not be taking part in something like that. Because he's the national hero for, the, for everybody. And I remember some of the Pam people, as usual, jump all over me. Oh, how you mean Simon must in this? How you mean Simon must in that? It's a native of the country, and if you could talk about going around. But that wasn't my point. My point was, Simon's you are the national hero. You are supposed to be representing everybody. You're not supposed to be taking sides. And some people see, oh, man, this national hero. What wrong if he talk? Man, it's your personal life. Okay. Let's give him that. Let us fast forward. Because at the time, the Pan people and the Unity people was defending Simmons. With the behavior against, I was against labor and Douglas and them. They defend, all right, not wrong with that. Let us fast forward 2022. Timothy Harris fired six guys. Okay? And when I keep saying all the time to people, where is Simmons in the middle of this fight? Because this now should be the man in the middle to say, look, hey, this is not what the country need. The country need the man in the middle of national hero to be telling. Because remember the time the abuse was going on between Pam 
and Tim, but even before that, remember last year the attack was launched on Dr. Joe. The attack was launched on Douglas. And our great national hero who was alive didn't jump in, didn't say nothing. He was also the, 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 the prime minister, didn't say nothing with all that was going on in the country. Didn't do absolutely nothing. But he sit down there and he watch them slaughter and the labor people. And at the same time, he's our national hero. He's not taking side, but he's supposed to say, Tim, hey, let's get this thing. No, we need to stop this. Um, Joe, let's get this thing. We need to stop this. Because you clearly see where he was going. See, man, sit down there and he said, absolutely nothing. Y'all can recall. The disrespect at meetings, when they had a COVID meeting, when Patrick get up and say, because it's Douglas Corona, nobody said nothing. See, man didn't say nothing. Nobody said nothing. And he is alive. Fast forward. Timothy Harris decided to fire six. Six of them out of the unity concept. Up comes Simmons now and start he launch an attack on the unity. Oh, this is Pam and Pam. Where do Simmons get in that? What we say? Oh, he could say what he want. And he start an attack on the unity concept. Well, when he start the attack on the unity concept, people, let's remember, which in far as I see, he had no call in that. He's supposed to be again the peacemaker. But everybody had their agenda. And look where he belonged to. Why I say we should never ever have or before when I finish, I'm gonna give the reason why. See my start the attack on unity because now. Timothy Harris for your Sean, for your Lindsay, for your Jonel. Now these are the Pam people. Simon is a Pam. And a big Pam. So what do you think happened? Start the attack. Well, guess what happened back now? Patches let off. Live on national radio. Busing Kennedy Alphonse Simmons. Who? They give the same national hero. Timothy say, not a thing. Timothy say, not a thing. This is our national hero, you know, Kennedy Alphonse Simmons. Patrick said they should take back the hero. There are people calling in on the radio, disrespecting Kennedy Simmons. Oh, he should have never been a national hero. Timothy should have never given him and one lot of way. Now the question is, how do our national hero end up in that mess? Should that happen? Should that should that ever happen? The man have had absolutely no respect for Simmons. I'm not defending Simmons, but I'm just gonna be real here. One, Simmons had no call in the argument. Because he should have been, as I'm saying, you're the national hero. Nobody have a problem with you being a Pam. That is acceptable. But the problem comes when it become a big rat up. Because Simmons went after unity, and unity went after Simmons. And for me, that was very disrespectful. When people listening to that, our first prime minister, our national hero and P. Patches was the ambassador on national radio ratting up Simmons and nobody Timothy Harris the prime minister ain't say one simple thing because all there was now is to attack all there was doing now is to be on the attack so what, what that put, what light that put on the, a living national hero? Because Apache says you should take it back from him. You must take back the national hero from Kennedy Simmons. Eh? Apache says take it back from him because they know feel. Let's start the ball. What Simmons now was doing was wrong. But when he was attacking labor, it was okay. 
You all understand what I'm saying? So in my humble opinion, whoever the next living national hero can be, they must be class. He can't be involved in a party. If there's a national function, something like the governor, we have the national function, yes. We can't talk about he going in a Labour Party meeting and then the Labour Party conference at talk. Or and a PAM meeting and a PAM conference at talk. He's supposed to be the one who is the national hero. When there's a crisis, when you see a, a, a feud, depending on how it is, but you cannot do, he cannot allow to do what Simmons did, what Simmons did. Because these guys bring this national hero thing in a big, nasty mess. And we must start the truth. I didn't have a problem giving Simmons. Some people say he shouldn't get it, okay? Because of what happened. That's not beside the point. But you cannot give him the national hero and turn around that he, on a podium at the time, was attacking labor. And some people said they didn't see a problem with it. The same unity people. And when I scream out, that's the other thing, you know, when I talk, oh, they had me, oh, cook this and that and that, okay. When the same Simmons now attack unity after Timothy Tonway and them, then the same unity people now after Simmons who was saying what I was saying was wrong. They went as far as national radio with Patches Liburd. They must take back the national hero thing from Simmons. Uh, okay then. And these are the things I'm saying. And as you say, you could see since 2010 the guy did for Douglas. And look what happened now. Patches now launch an attack on Douglas and Tim and Simon. Timothy Harris, who give the man the national hero, had no respect for Simmons. And then Simmons turned around had no respect for, for, for Tim. So you see where the national hero end up? You see where this good, prestigious award end up? In big international confusion. That should have never happened. So how now somebody could convince me, Curtis Cook, to give a living person the National Hero Award? How? How? I will like somebody. How, how are you going to convince me now after what happened with Simmons and them? But you can't come at the eyes. France can't come at the eyes. The one in Nevis can't come at the eyes. But Simmons was allowed to make noise. And embarrass the whole operation. He and Patches and, and, and Timothy Harris them. Can embarrass us. He come up here paying attention. These guys have embarrassed the Federation of Sinkets and Nevis. Because should people listen outside when Patches on? Say take back and people call in the work program, you know. Take it back. But court is cook how is it be disrespectful? Take back the national hero from Simmons. Simmons this, Simmons that. The same Simon some years ago. When he talk about was on duck labor and the attack. I say it was wrong. You're the national hero, Simmons. You shouldn't be doing that. And the people said they say nothing wrong. Timothy fired him and them. And all of a sudden now, Simon started abuse. And then Patrick started abuse. And nowhere in that you hear Timothy Harris come out and say, it is wrong. You ain't hear the church people, you ain't hear nobody. This week a man calling the radio freedom win FM telling the man what people are tackling. They said, not a soul call. Timon, Timothy said, no time. No time. Timothy Harris stopped patches or a destination. Again, no time. Timothy had, I mean, Simmons, a trusty nation. He went at a convention to talk. But you is the national hero, Simmons. 
And I fully believe. Colonel! Colonel! Bring my charger by. For the tablet. For the tablet. And I fully believe. But you bring it to the work with me. What you tell me? And I fully believe that that is what should have happened. Charger for this. And I fully believe that somebody should have got in the middle. But nobody, because you see, some supporting the Labour Party, sorry, some supporting the Unity Party, and some supporting, look at him, some supporting the Unity Party, and some, give me a minute there. Yeah. Some supporting the Unity Party, and some were supporting the Pan Party. So people was afraid to say, what Simon's doing is wrong. And the Pam side and on the, the, the unity side, they feel the same. What Simon's doing is wrong, what Timothy was doing is wrong. And they was asking to revoke Kennedy Simmons. He will think. When a deggy demanded you. So people, I am not, nobody could convince me that we need to go back down that road. Or Whoever gonna be the national hero, they must be class. They cannot be taking part in no politics. They could go and vote. We know who they voting for. But they should not be active. No politics at all. Unless they come into if you got disaster, they come into pull us together. Because remember some years ago, you know, that same thing there is what? Kind of turn a lot of people against Kim Collins yeah, to him. And people didn't see it as a serious thing. I could recall and I don't remember. When he went upon the platform for Pam with our foolishness. When you forget that when you win the race, it was everybody on the bypass. When you're a certain level, you has no car to get caught. You could support your party. I can't tell a man he can't be a labor. He could be a labor. Kim could be a Pam. You could go to the Pam thing and okay. You can't go up on the podium and disrespecting people. That must cause a problem. Because wait away you're done, you're making the divide even better. Because look what Timothy do for this for this for the country for years. Look what happened to Simon, that's what I'm saying. They might end up turning on now and divide bam. Divide Simon's had people disrespecting Simon. That's what happened. Yeah? Timothy turn around had people disrespecting. Kennedy Alphonse Simmons, our first national hero and prime minister. That's what Patrick's job. And the, poli the politics and the culture and all of Mr. Garley. Some of the people here calling in to disrespect Simmons. I was like, really? Okay. So where's the standard? Where was the standard? And it's been going on all the time. Look at how people are calling in, a man that talk about respect. Look at how people used to call in and disrespect Bacho. Man, they say, Cook, don't call Timothy a big stone. I can call Timothy a big stone because he come after me personally. He lie on me. So I can call him a big stone because if he could write a letter, get the port where letter to say I'm a high risk. Why I can't call him a big stone? But tell you the one they want to see, they want to see. And that's the problem. But I wouldn't say Kim Collins does not deserve the metal bottle. I'm going on that road. Because the man have done a lot for the country. I'm saying if Kim was be a Pam, I'm going to Pam with Kim Collins being a Pam. The problem I had with Kim Collins when he went up on the podium and said, talk about labor people. Kim could have support Pam, but he business. Kim could have support Labour that he business. But don't nobody who in a high at league can have any time to go up and no. Not even Labour platform to say they're disrespecting Pam people. Because when you're out there representing the country, people see you as you. When Small Axe went in England, I had a EK. Me never back Small Axe. But I see Small Axe as a sink is banned. So I'm going to look for them. I pet to go to the dance, guys. It's the same kids. When Mark Brantley, who had abuse every day, and so how we wicked and he bad and all kind of thing. When the string ban and all went Nevis when England for England fifty leagues carnival and make sure we're gonna look for them. 
take black man to cricket to make sure that they was okay. All of us used to lie. Me. We never meet, but should that someone come and become good? Because all I seen is sink it and these people. When I go somewhere, I see me sink it flag like happy. So I'm gonna say that Kim Collins, Kim Collins is all whatever you get. The problem I had with it is when you disrespect him. And that was some of his problem. Whoever was leading him and guiding him was leading him wrong. Because they drag him into the politics. When he get the house, he went down like a, a dog bike when he get the house. Oh, I get the house to me. Mother and all these kind of foolishness. As far as I see, people got can't let people outsmart them. Because Pam used Kim Collins. He used the youth, the youth man because I guess the youth man was young. He didn't really understand what going on. He had some people around him, wasn't encouraging him in the right way. But Kim McCall and pulled him and Kim still at leak. When you're done and you decide to go in politics, the ghosts and all them, man, you get rid of your business. You're finished with things. You can't want to be at leak and still jumping up and pull them on top of When you go, 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 who, gonna support you? who you want to support you? When you let off on the people. So these are some of the things I'm talking about. So Kim calling for me. When Dr. the Labour Party gave him the house and he get what he get, Kim deserve it. Because he put us on the map when he's standing up on the line. When the man said Kim calling from Sink is in Nevis, I'm happy to see that. Because I used to follow Kim all the way through. Up when he came back when he went in the middle, I walked the flight. But I was disappointed when he ended up on the plant platform and behave like that. With nobody telling him, the palm people should have back Kim, now we can't do this. The man ain't go up and say, okay, but let's have a peaceful election. Tomorrow, okay. Kim is a palm, I can't tell you, don't be a palm. But don't get caught up, and none of the athletes and sportsmen should get caught up in politics like that. Not even if it's labor. Unless you're going up to speak, we're not disrespecting Pam. Speak with labor. Or what you would like labor to do. Or what you would like Pam to do. You can't get caught up on the podium with these people. When you're done with your sport in where we're doing, then you could join the politics race. Because I can remember the Pam in behind you, you know. Is the labor people was saying run, Kim, run. So I'm just saying. So when you analyze all of these things, this is my biggest problem I have with this thing of this national EU. We got to be very careful now going forward. How we're going to do this now. And, and again, it don't have to be politician. It could be we got so much. We got, as I said, we let this say, you got Kikayama Gums, you got so much of people. But how are we going to deal with it going forward? Should these guys be alive? Should they have a clock that they can't get caught up in the politics regardless of who power in, regardless of what? They go election there, they go on the vote. But it shouldn't be in tune like how what happened with Simmons. And, and Tim and all these people for our independent, our, our national hero, the way how, how it was happening on the radio. It was a big stinking fight. That is, is as far as I see, is no joke. Um, going forward again now, Nathaniel France. Nathaniel France. You see, Again, here we go. When you have people like Sylvie and Henry, some people say don't call any of but you have to. Because I always believe when people say things and you just leave it, they get away. Because remember, the generation today are paying attention. Eh? If you watch what happened the other day in the convent school, convent school of all, when the Labour candidate them and the politician went and the song they were singing, get rid of them. At not 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 village school, St. Paul school, you know. Convent school, the private school. Not one person, everybody sing the song in there. So it means then they are paying attention. But I'm saying when people like Sylvie and them coming on the radio and being so dishonest, being so disrespectful, I'll be the type of people disrespectful, you know. A lot of them don't want to touch the real disrespect people. You say something on the radio, quick to say you're disrespectful. When Patches and Sylvie and all them on the radio, nobody will call and say they're disrespectful. Nobody called Patches and tell him he was disrespectful to Simmons. But the other man won't call quicker when FM because you call Sylvie name, you be in Some people only know the disrespect word, depending on who you be. The point I'm saying, Joseph Nathaniel Franz, I live in this village all my life. 
And I can remember a small boy going to Fran's house. No flush toilet, the toilet was in the back. One light in the roof, hanging down. A petition, so the room was in the back. We go in, he said, sit down, sit down in the chair. He signed your passport. If you ain't got the money for food, you get a little two dollars to go for your breakfast or whatever. All he is. France was a very hopeful man. Yes, very hateful. A lot of hate and wickedness in your heart when it comes to labor. But people still need to know who she be. When she talk, we, we must follow on what she say. And coming up in the community, France was very hopeful, down to earth person. I could tell. I mean, there is some somebody come on the page and say, "Are oh, you talking about France? Or nothing about France?" <laughs> And I just laugh. Maybe they think at 22. That's it. And living in number three. Sylvina also used to live in number three. Right? She used to live down Millennium Street. Never ever like nothing called labor. The same just now. I don't know what labor do, Sylvine. I don't know what Bratcher do, Sylvine. But that woman just hate labor with a passion. I mean, asking you. I'm telling you. Sylvie never ever defend nothing in this community here. Okay? Never. Every knock boat we get, every woman can knock boat in this country. Baby. Edna. And we go on and on. Dear mother and all of them who get knock boat as woman on the Simmons. Sylvie never once addressed it. One lady, she went where Puerto Rico get knocked down and killed Jersey mother. She was a cleaner at the hospital. Baby, Alex Riley, mother. She was a clean. How much children she had? Edna couldn't get a job. That's for labor. And I could go on and on. Both man and woman in this community. Sylvie, sit down and look Pam. Look at Pam. Treat this community like nothing. But then she like to come and say she's a villager. Ask her what she has done for the village. She can't tell you. What is your contribution for the village? She can't tell you. Because there's none. Because she never used to associate with village people like that. Because most of the people in the village is labor. When I hear Sylvie talking, please. Rubbish. So what I'm saying. And I listened to Sylvie in Gali Radio Station this week. Joseph Nathaniel Franz. Sylvie, no. The word of France and know what the youth man have done for the community. You go up in the village city house, one little with a little landing. France used to walk go walk every morning. And when Sylvie called call the way the other day, I'm gonna say that France, Nevis people do not like France. Because France left Nevis and never looked back. Come sink it and join with the, with Bracho. That is why these people don't like him. He don't know nothing for me. Because the question was asked him. How come Mark Bradley don't talk about France? Think about it, people. Anyone I ever hear Mark Bradley say anything about no Joseph Nathaniel France? What the hospital name Martha? And Sylvine said, Nevis people didn't like France. Because he left Nevis, he didn't look back. He came to sink it, mind. If he left Nevis, he went to America. Yeah. He come sink it. I thought we sink it in Nevis all these years. But she said he never looked back. I don't know. She always knew about the story. She said he never looked back. And that's the reason why. And because he ended up went and joined with Bracho. I could imagine that. Them kind of thing they were saying, telling the generation to come. That's why we got to be on with game. We got to ex let our children know the story and the truth. He never looked back. So that's the reason why these people didn't like him because he went to join with Bracho. Well, I didn't know join him with Bracho was a crime. I didn't know join him with labor was a crime. Well, what I want to tell Sylvain, the statue of Mark Bradley put up in Nevis, the other day, the white man. Where were you, you born, Nevis? What have you done for Nevis? Sylvie ain't gonna question that. 
Et donc, le sac peut pas statue. Ah, this is a white man. I want to hear the night. But she, talking about France, who just left Nevis and come sink it. But the man who had the money, and where were the statue of Mark Brown, just put up in Nevis. Then somebody tell me, what a white man do for Nevis? But he named on the money, I picture on the money. I was born in Nevis, well. What have you done with Nevis? These people they still need a visit to America. Do Nevis people need a visit to America? Mm. Somebody tell me. Nevis people are in a visit to America? Somebody explain to me. But Bracho, Sylvie wouldn't tell you what Bracho do for Nevis. Bracho do nothing at all for see Nevis. To come up with things born in supernatural. Nothing at all he do for Nevis. Nothing. But the Nevis people still need a visa. So what the reason for that statue in Nevis? The man born in Nevis, he named him the money, he was where, where, where. So Nevis people supposed to get the nod in going to America. Not me. In St. Kitts, can we buy in St. Have a drink again. But why need these people need a visa to go to America? With a statue of a white man up there. Somebody explain that to me. We like to make it simple and easy for everybody. Huh? France! Need these people ain't like him. They hate France because he joined with Placho. Alright. But Nevis people love the statue with the white man in Nevis. Who when they want to go to America, they need a visa. Why Sylvie don't go sit to us down? She don't understand she's getting old. I love old people, I love to see the citizen. But Sylvie is one of the most dishonest, disrespectful old woman in this country. I mean, let us be real people. Why, why, why insult Joseph Nathaniel France and the family, his family with them kind of statement? Why, why? Tell me why. Somebody tell me why. Why insult the man? Why insult the man's name? Nobody seems to listen. That's what the island keep talking. People seem to don't listen to these people. This woman. But yet they like it is a cookie trying to insult people. Why insult the beat the man? Why? What is the insult for? That like he left Nevis, he not look back, and he joined with Bracho. That is why Nevis people do not like France. So I mean he not look back, he don't do nothing for Nevis at all. So he don't deserve nothing. But you have a statue in Nevis with a white man. So the white man should have come and come talk about Africa and Africa and Africa. She didn't want to talk nothing about the statue. And you're right, the statue need to pull to us down. Because down here with the soccer, it's more black and black. But when Nevis don't pop a statue with Bracho. They want Douglas out of Nevis, yeah. They said virtually not the top of Nevis. But they get away and, and Nevis people need a visa to go to America. But they got a statue of the white man up there. Say the man born in, born in Nevis, but they went to America. Okay. What Cicely Tyson done for Nevis? That was the name. She just started that about Nevis lately. What have she done for Nevis? Sylvine said, Fans left off and they ain't do nothing. What city the Tyson do for Nevis? Somebody tell me. But France shouldn't be recognized in Nevis. This is the kind of wicked 
wicked, heartless people we got. That is why Simmons and them used to behave so. Because people like Sylvie and Henry was very instrumental in the behavior of Pam. That is why Timothy could have behaved so. Because people like Sylvie and Henry and them was very instrumental in these guys' behavior towards the citizens of this country. Because they never ever see they do nothing wrong. This is what we're supposed to go back to. This is what the present crop of politicians are supposed to be heading in the same direction. Now we have a set of young, vibrant. Look at all the school kids greeting these guys. That's what I keep saying all the time. We have to go in the election with a young set of people. Let the kids grow into them. That asking who they be. Look at the leader. Look at Drew. Look at Marsha. Look at the Adrian. And the champion behind, just dear. Denzel Douglas. Look at the team. Look at Conway's. You could see the energy. You could feel the energy. Look at the team. Look at how the young people greet them in every school. Look at it. Take a look. Children don't, children don't pretend, people. Children does not pretend. Are you watching? Seven years in our city, the unity government, they're not going to greet them in school. Never. Because children know when they see love. Children know when they love. They some the energy to tell them. If you child child running from somebody, you know something wrong. And we should have pick a long time. Because the children are running from unity long time. They had no ban. Ain't a ban was playing in the school. But look at the kids them. Look at the can why why is the key here the convent school? Look at how they greet. Get rid of them and say, why the hell may I see ya? This is a private school. You understand what I'm saying? Look at the kids today. Look at all, look at all the videos. This is the, the greeting. You could see the love. You could see the kids them feel, ah, we're happy to see. Look at the difference at the go to each school in this country. All the kids them see me and know them. And they're not pretending, they're not acting. They got the teacher because they all what they want. They could understand. You remember here Douglas walked along in the circus? And you want to know if it's Douglas is the prince. Or the children want to doggy, 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 doggy. Because the children understand and they don't love. So with all what some people trying to do, look at today. So we gotta we gotta we gotta stay focused. Because there's a lot of people and sometimes we might say, oh don't study them. <clears throat> these are issues that we need to study when it comes to Sylvia and some of these people. We have to, we have to pay attention. Because you see, we let a lot of things slide and not realizing it could creep up. Because the dishonest, and that's what they keep doing, Shane Mark Brent and all them, the hatred to sink it. Put me with people against sink his people. But just say this, this said that, to put us to go against each other. Listen to Mark all the time. He always believe in fighting. So he don't end up, he said, walking with Tim. Always believe he specializes in putting people against each other. But the hide, you never come in an open forum to talk your foolishness. He always gonna hide, hide. He either go in his shop, he go in somebody's shop, but he not make no phone call, and he want to tell you what question to ask him, and how to ask him. We never come in a forum. When last you see him come on EK, he like the pitch bouncy. But we never come on EK. You know why? Because he's going to chop at the line. But he's going to program, he's hiding. He's going to web up, he's going to shield him. And when he comes to an interview, he wants to tell you a question to ask him. 
Vaccine in my question. But you come in and making you feel like you so want to have answer. That's the kind of people we have leading us. And Sylvie is a part of that. So we gotta pay attention. Nevis got election coming up. She's gonna do everything in your power to shield Mark. Then when the fellow come on the radio talking about the IMF, he said, Oh, Peter said, Oh, well, yes, the government. And then when he started to ask about the IMF report, she been come back the other day and take the, the man and my man to the cleaners. Oh, they're playing politics and politics and all the man said, I want to see the IMF report. Years ago, Sylvie knew and see every IMF report, Douglas, when Douglas was in power. Everyone. Up to when the IMF said, we're doing good, she said, Dougie pay the IMF. Up to when the people in the IMF say, you know, why we're doing well. And the IMF report was shown, <coughs> Dougie pay the IMF. But now we're asking for this one. Nobody pay them. Now we can't see it. And I said, the man saying, I have to tell you, man, I don't want to match me. You can't miss you anything, whatever you say. But you appreciate sure that you want to see the IMF report. And that is Sylvie for you. Very dishonest. And as my little girl said, dishonest, this thief. Lies a thief. She doesn't say it. She said, my mother tell us what. When you lie is a thief. Very dishonest. She know attacking the man. A woman calling the other than the radio, saying what she got to say. The woman up to now did not say she's a palm, labor, or nothing. The woman doesn't talk. She calling to say that's when you're supporting the Labour Party. People we got to focus. Some easy, as I say, some people could say, Oh, don't listen to her. But you gotta listen. Because she bringing a message. And the generation, you know, we go. We still got to focus with them. They're still fragile. Because she's elder. A lot of people don't go with that. Because she's the elder. So we got to be very careful. So I don't know why the attack on Nathaniel France or Nathaniel France. She has family. It was only she could attack people and people's family. When you call in and you say, Sylvie, why your daughter left the country? You're attacking her. But she launched an attack on France and it's okay. These are the things we need to know. You know, focus on. The other thing I want to talk about, let's drink. It's concerning the honorarium. Why are the card what you say you're gonna pay? Last year we look at Timothy Harris, the biggest one. Bus up three hundred thousand dollars between a group of people. Some people get twenty seven thousand. Some get 27,000, I think some get 10,000, but it was a bus up among the elite. I've been talking, I've been balling, I've been marching, I've been doing everything even before that come up. And I find it strange that, you know, when we got in March, nobody has shown up, when I call on the radio, some people say, yeah, we to talk politics. Some of the same unity people working for the government know they're getting about, but they're not saying nothing. Then we come around to the COVID. A lot of people was fired from the COVID. I didn't even know. It's only now the government changed. You know, so much people was run home from the COVID because they become vocal now, because money involved. And I fought Danny. The girl from Ram, B, Source, and all these people, a couple people well. And then we were marching, 
we can't get a hundred people because some people see it that it was politics oh cook leave it alone you're going over the same thing over and over these are some of the the backlash court is used to get and i decided i'm gonna fight on i'm good to fight on when i asking for people to come to protest we ain't seen nobody but all of a sudden now dr juice let me even forget to that when timothy pay the money i know we got a lot of police I know we have a lot of nurses. I know we have a lot of army men. I know we have a lot of firemen. You understand what I'm saying? We are all these people here. Yeah. Up to when the nurse came on this program, come on freedom, and she speak about a killer, Nisbet, wicked behavior. They said the nurse was crazy. Some nurse, one of the nurse, them had their own fake Facebook page wearing red belt because I ended up set up and I find out exactly who she was. It was all on the show. Texting when she fell a nurse on the show, fighting for them. Still got a screenshot from the nurse. And I got a picture because I, I like to save things. I say she crazy. I expect the nurse them to say yes. We're standing in solidarity with our fellow nurse. Waiting up. I say she crazy. She playing politics and nobody support the nurse. But the nurse had a valid point. And everybody sit back. You expect the nurses to strike because they see when the FIPS get the money. You expect the police to strike because they see Juicy get the money. You expect the, 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 the fireman to strike. And Timothy A. make no mention about paying none of them the money. None. Because father said he didn't care to hell with them then. And nobody, everybody seemed to be afraid to sound the voice. Let's fast forward. We fought and we fought. We got the victory. You became the prime minister. The man said, in the briefing and openly, now that they went to cabinet and they're gonna pay this money all of a sudden everybody want the money it come up in the first week or two weeks and everybody vocal and i agree i agree that for me all in us you should get the money All the firemen should get the money. And all the police should get the money. That was on the front line. My case is different. But I'm saying that these people also got fired from other companies the same way like us. But never come forward. Some of them are supporting the government. Even that the government make them lose the job. Because it's a cuckoo's playing politics. But all of a sudden, that group they want to put out their hand first. And the money must come now. Because Jew is lying. No the man say you can pay the money. Let us wait and see how the money gonna pay. But everybody up and down on Facebook, oh Jew, he can pay. Wonder how much he can pay. I'm not, well, how come I know asking that when the $27,000 back out?
How come? And I agree. If the if the aim make sure that they pay all the nurses, I think that's a problem in fairness to them. Every single nurse should get the money. Even though you had some of them who was against but they work. But the problem I have with them when they didn't when Timothy not say he gonna give nothing. I felt them seem like they was afraid for what I don't know. And if some of them same people who was fired from some of them company, including some of them from TDC, who never stood up, who never stand up. But all of a sudden, everybody know who's supposed to get money. And I believe that all the nurses should get their money. Those single them out, all them had to work. All the police and all the firemen, they had to work. The ambulance drivers, they had to work. But wait. It's official that the man already make it official. He's going to pay the money. But when Tim refused to pay the money, when Cook Up and Nong champion in the cause about the money, and asking and screaming, Nobody want to talk. Girl, man, look, lady, I didn't say nothing for the army man. You ain't even a call a name. I ain't got in for the foolishness tonight. Because when Tim did pay the 27,000, you didn't say nothing. I hide behind our page and fear to talk. So don't come here with your bullshit tonight, tell me about the army man. Because when they talk about the army man, When you're going to come and say, the army man, I mean, ain't nobody. If nothing for them. Well, you know, I'm going to tell Tim so. Well, you know, I'm going to ask Tim if nothing was for them. That's the problem. Is this is the people that you are talking about. People like you are talking about. When they ain't going to pay you, you ain't come and say a damn thing. Because I'm afraid Tim, you were supporting Tim and the bullshit. So don't come here with the foolishness. That's what I'm saying. I'm talking about everybody who was in that field who was on the front line for government. What are you doing with a deer put up and ask Tim if, they, if, if the nurse and everybody say nobody? Stop your foolishness. This is real time. People attack you. Yeah. Because that time I had no more when Tim was doing the bullshit to people. So my Facebook page, I just pop up anything and fear to talk, call out Tim. But everybody don't want the money right now, two weeks. He can't work so. He got to make sure he put things in order. When Timothy paid the sugar money and you had people who work in the sugar industry for years and work hard not getting the money. Not get a soul of money. Timothy pay money. Millions of dollars. Got people in the square like dog. I don't know he can't tell us if the money finish. Or what happened to the money. I got people to that woman call me asking me about it. Same thing with sugar money. Because she knows somebody family walk in the sugar money and get nothing. No, no, I question. So don't come here tonight with your foolishness, my friend. This is serious time. Very serious time. Tell the mother can answer the phone. Yeah, so I'm saying, let us be real, my people. The man on official officially said, I'm saying again, for the lady there, the army, the police, the nurses, the doctors, all these people was working, the garbage man, everybody should get their money because that is what we fought for. And you officially said they are going to get their money. You're going to pay. I don't know who you're going to pay, how you're going to pay, but you say you're going to pay something. So if he's going to pay, how everybody want the money in a week? How everybody want the money in two weeks? All of a sudden everybody woke up. I know some people following this, 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 this clown in America. They call Everton Elliot Obi with his shippiness. But oh, uh, some people should give me something. Obi, how the hell you could get something when you were supporting the dictator Timothy Harris? 
You never want to tell Timothy boy how you pay 27,000. But you're putting a puppy show yourself. Can't you EK? That, that, oh, well, they should give you something. What are they supposed to give you? You were supporting Timothy wicked, evil, nasty behavior. But you're trying to push yourself forward and say, you create something. What you create? What did you create? And I'm saying to the people, to my people, I'm happy that I can get money and everybody who can get. But what I'm disappointed in, that a lot of other people didn't come forward to make the noise when Timothy paid $27,000 because I had a golden opportunity to shut down the country. But the man said he can pay and I want to pressure the man. But didn't pressure Tim. He said, I tell him, but thank you, Tim. Thank you, sorry, Dr. Drew. Thank you in your first couple of months. Come, come to the nation to say, you're going to pay this money. Thank you. That's what I'm supposed to be telling the man. Thank you, Timothy. I mean, I'm saying the, the biggest one. Thank you, Dr. Drew, for telling us that you're going to pay some kind of money to us. Who was on the front line? If it's fifty dollars in the lot, if it's ten dollars in the lot, cut him a tiggy eye and nothing at all. So let us wait. We fall into independence, people. So all what the plan maybe he might have had. We gotta focus on the independent. But somehow is so greedy. I don't know why we act like this as people. If you didn't say you're gonna pay the money. Then we could have been saying, but Tim, but Joe, you're getting power. What happened to us? Are you going to pay something? The question could have been asked. But it's a very really clean cabinet. He said, the guy come to the nation and tell us that he said he's going to pay the frontline workers. And frontline workers must comprise not just the nurses, the doctors, the police, and all that. We got to also look at the garbage man. We must look at the garbage man. Here with the the other day. Because if these garbage people don't take up the garbage, how the hell are you think that we gonna what do you think will happen? If the gap the most important people in this country is the garbage man, yeah? Because let's say two weeks they don't take up the garbage, what do you think happened to it to us? So they must be a part of whatever. So I hope they're gonna sit down and walk it up with the man already say you're gonna pay. So let us wait. We have independence coming up. So you must expect, but everybody wants it in rush. Because some of you in a clown in America called Obi, Everton Elliott. And none of I was opening up your mouth. Some of you were going to Timothy meeting and all. Because I was papi showing all yourself. Tell you one nurse in Red Belt. On a page, a fake page. The woman's a clowny that I end up set up easy like Sunday morning. I shame him now. Because the same person and the same person the next thing. And I put it together. And I ask questions. I say, by yeah, she's a nurse. Pop, and I get the work name and the picture. I got it still, screenshot. Because she wasn't supporting the nurse. Because she was focusing on supporting the big stone. But now she now going to get money. If people like them, they shouldn't get the money. People like them, they shouldn't get a red cent in the country. And these are the things we're talking about. We got to pay attention, people. Stop force the man. You think I won't like we the TDC workers and what we say you can do it? We like them money right now. If it's one person who could ball for the money right now, I should be I should be the first. I should be on the front line. Making the most noise. Because when I thought I was quiet, I was fighting as everybody does say. But I missed style. That's not missed style. We never move like that. Everybody, all them traffic warden, everybody's supposed to get the money. Who was working on the front line for the government? That's all I'm saying. But all I'm saying, when I hear people making nice in fairness to Dr. Drew and his team, who no want to make nice like that and making nice about getting the money one time and fast, should be the least to talk. Should be the least to talk. Because... When they see Timothy pay them a lot of big money, I mean, no surprise. Was a golden opportunity to shut down this country. I don't know how I'm afraid. 
So at the end of the day, yes, I'll probably vote for Dr. Drew, which is a great move. But then give him some time now. Give the man some time. Yes, everybody vote for Dr. Drew. And I fight for Dr. Drew and I fight for Labour to get in power. But I still gonna have to have the patient. When I decided they want to see Drew, I went down there, the man said, Boy, cook. Today's Monday, they're in cabinet, you're gonna come back next week. I said, All right. You think I went down the way, Joe? You think I'm Momo? Next week, I went back down again and I made the appointment. The man said, I said, Okay. And I got you with my appointment. Come on, people. Let us pay attention. That's why I gotta keep talking. Because a lot of things people can get carried away with. The man already said it's official. People, it's official. The, the boy come and he say to us that he mean that money come back. All I'm saying, for people who behave in this way, I'm very disappointed in all you. Because all you see Timothy pay 27,000 and nobody will make a nice. I was him coming on Facebook. I was him coming on the radio. And it's good the Labour Party like that where people could free to express themselves and nothing wrong with that. But we can't be expressing ourselves like this, that we're rushing everything. It's a process. You can't do things like the big stone. That is why the man said the country was running, look how he was running, look a, 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 a family bank and a family, like that, because everything was just boop, 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 boop. He come on the way to say, oh, he gonna get this money? Pop, you have kind of man get the money. They come on the way to they walk up and say, oh, cook, you get your fix, cook, five pallet, five, two and eleven. Oh, you've, but when you go up to this, you see the amount of thousands of things I was giving out to people. Because that's how it was. Some get house, some get tiles, some get cement, some get this, some get that. Out of the roofing. Because a lot of bubble was going on. Millions of dollars spent. So I want you to end up in the same position. You got to make sure it will be done right. Make sure it's done proper. I ain't telling her I may want my money. I wish I could get it next week. I wish I could get it again. From the time government change. But it's a protest process. And we need to understand that. And with time, we got to start act civilized. Mind me, not abuse nobody the same. People, yes, a lot of people didn't vote for a lot of things, and I agree too that a lot of people got to move. But I'm just saying, when it comes to this money story, I'm disappointed this is how some people behaving. Like Dr. Drew in there for 10 years. Two months in him gone, but he don't make it clear he can pay. But he don't say who get the wedding again. And then my humble opinion, you take all the money from when they fix them. They should pay back that money, because they don't deserve the money. They do nothing for the money. Yes, Juicy couldn't answer me. When I asked him what he do to get 27,000 in the park. Can I I'm saying we now got to take stock of what's going on. Let us give the man some time when it comes to this money. Don't follow some of them jokey unity people because they're all about dragging down. They're trying to do every. A fella meet me the other person. Oh, we're gonna see dictator now because Marcel now become the gonna become the governor. I said okay. Victimized, victimized. The man was victimized. Who, who victimized? Who, who got victimized? The mother's sister. Who the people get victimized? Who the people? Because everybody using the word loosely. Everybody using the word loosely. You gotta take your time. You hear Timothy say, "Oh, peace, money." There's your man, people getting the money. Man, I always see this, I get the money. But the people here who are supposed to get the peace money, some of them can't get it. The woman who lose her child to the violence can't get even that the government can take care of the child to college. Can't get that. But people in St. Thomas, they say, in America, but I always get the money. And I can't get the money. How can get the money? But you're fooling the boys, them telling them, oh, well, you're looking after all you. But giving them a little bit of money, making them feel good. What about the same boys, them who lose a child? Who's still alive? Who somebody else killed somebody else? 
We're looking after the child. Because it's peace, so it means that everybody's supposed to be taken care of. And these are things I believe we need to look into too. But we want to rush that. You're supposed to pay the money right now. And half of the, half of the time, 90% of the people them are free to talk. And I'm saying, do not single out nobody. All the nurses work. I believe all them. Well, if they say who don't get, can't get, that's it. But I believe all the nurses deserve a little, a little something. All the doctors deserve a little something. All the, 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 the man in solid waste deserve a little something. The army man, them deserve a little something. Remember, he went up the army and disrespect the army man, them, you know. The same COVID story. You know? Everybody deserve a little something. Who walk during the COVID. That is facts. That is fear. Because they was on the front line. The port workers, they're on the front line. So let us not get sidetracked. Just wait. Because the man blow up a lot of money and I wasn't saying nothing. Yeah. Some of my religious gonna go walk with nothing and I wasn't saying a damn thing and watching the man blow up a lot of cash. Look at the election. But Timothy get some money from to spend up. But then I met the nice. Bring all kind of artists, do this, do that, do that. And I make a nice. And I question where the cash coming from. Big TV screen out in a house in Sunny Point and all kind of thing. Brand new house up Monkey Hill, build fast, fast. Nobody make the nice. Nobody question the money. Free the concert, big concert down here, Baker's car all over. House on Baker's car, paint up, this paint and that. Nobody make the nice. Don't I ask him more money? Where the money going? Where he come from? Where he spending up the money? The all I know, want to rush you to pay this money. We ain't gonna work here. No, we ain't gonna work, sir. The man gotta take your time, the man gotta analyze. Here some people ball out, oh, they, 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 they ain't get the money, the people ain't get the money. Well, I suppose they get paid 1,000%. But not when the man reaching them, it's a big stinking mess. When you see some names on the paper, who shouldn't be on the pep, and on this, who shouldn't be on that, some money got kind of money. You know, I met another for weeks. Who are you going to subject and Who are you going to done? You know, I met another for weeks again, all a lot of money. And Timothy was actually paying weeks. Big money. Week was Nima. Weeks was Nima no fun line. Day man, week wasn't him and no for nine. But collect big cash, get double salary in December, get this, get that. I ain't tell him, hey. Man, I just relax for a second, please. Because I ain't gonna allow that. As I say, everybody deserve the money. When it come to this thing, what you gonna say? When it come to the other part with the people who get fired with vaccine, them they don't have fight their own canon. Because I can't believe so much people was fired from this vaccine and all them sit down and take and ain't say nothing. Everybody now showing up. But when I was saying come protest, or you speak out, everybody feel right on the turn right. I don't get on right. But beaks met big money. And the nurses them sit back. The police sit back. Everybody sit back. No, no, I said, but let me come together. When one did not ball out, they say she crazy. I write the woman. Now all of a sudden, everybody don't want the money fast. And they want it now. They want it now. I know we work people. I know better than that. You are no better than that. So let's just act. Good night, good night. Let us act better than that. Let us give some time. Give the man time. He say, you're going to pay the money, you're going to pay the money. All I'm saying to you people, don't let the boy in America make a in a puppy show. Because when he had Timothy up and down the place, puppy showing, doing people as they like, 
crushing people in this country. That's why some of nurses are so difficult to talk and police and army man and everybody. Is is Obi was behind that? Everton Elliot. He support that. Because as he said, he was doing a job. He was getting paid. So once you pay him, he good. Then these are the kind of people we got. Said the low sink it. Once you pay OB to do foolishness, he good. He doing a job. You think you could tell me pay me to do a job to charge openness to people? I mean, come here on Facebook, come talk to I put foolishness on my page and it's allow my country. Some of these people think they'll be talking to idiots. You allow your country and a man going to pay you to oppress your people and you're happy. Then they knock up and they talk about the love of black people and black people and black. That's why you listen to a lot of them. A man going to pay you and you know clearly the man oppressing us. He oppressing us, it's clear to see. But you, you say, you, 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 well, I'm doing a job. So because you're doing a job, you're comfortable. The government change. And all of a sudden now, you're up and down telling people, oh, uh, you're taking long to pay, victimization, and this and that and that. Why is he not ahead? My people pay attention. Just pay attention. Just focus on what is going on. Concerning the other concern, I see a lot of people really, really making noise about these lot of people still in jobs and in position. Two points in my other point, you know, because when you got people weeks on them on Facebook disrespecting people still. They put up Marcella as deputy governor. When they may we can put up, they can't find nobody else better. But when Michael Powell was in charge as advisor, when the gear stopped the seating and the old woman who was in cabinet secretary and, and uh, I mean, come on. And we still on government job. I never disrespect the Penny family. I have an issue with the family. I have an issue with the double. I got a political issue with the um, massive. Never had an issue with Dulgeo. But the other day I got a text. Let me say it again here too. From Dulgeo Penny. Oh, you come back with all this drink for she put a massive. The family is a bigger labor than me and all that kind of thing. Well, I didn't have a, I didn't have a problem with the family. Me abusing the family. Me saying nothing about the family. I'm speaking about massive behavior. I could remember the take with me ID from the airport, yeah. You would think the massive is exporting the airport, he come on and he had all kind of things to say. And everything was lie. But he was happy that Timothy take with me ID. His sister ain't said no time. And cook. Man, my brother wrong. We're going to answer with you. Don't you forget you work with me when they chart the flight to Gargola. When they do one point all this stuff and I say it can't happen. This is Timothy them they're going to the plane. Never once she said nothing. But now we're talking about he need to park up the car. Everybody's saying about his behavior. One of the man says she right, was, a, was a immigration, right to the bus. Nothing been done. All in the government, in the middle of government headquarters behavior. Yeah, he can talk about it. She never once said about partner in it, but he need to behave himself. I respect people. Call in the way she try to disrespect me. Try to abuse everybody. Launch and boy up personally. Launch on me personally. Never want she say to she go up. But when text me phone the other day to tell me some kind of shippiness. As I tell her, don't even text me phone again. Because I am not, I'm dealing with the situation that it is. Because oh you accuse me, you massive and all I accuse me. Penny. Make people feel that like I was this bad man in the airport. Because you're just in, you're just continue supporting wrong. You call the radio, you write everybody. In public, you pack up the car, you do what you want, and you get on. 
But doctor, you need to shake up these people. I was calling for all you. People like all you. Don't be like me, I agree. But I never disrespect and behave like all you. So if it's so, doctor, you got to do something. And the people is right. Because in a nutshell, you know, when you look at this whole situation, a lot of these people can't be trusted for sure. A lot of the people who right now in this position are Kabak News. Because Timothy Harris had put them in the is every position they had in this country, Timothy put them. Why do you think people could have come in here with the passport for the first time and nobody had them a question like that? Because the immigration officer, some of them up there working with him. It's everything. When you go to national security, the same thing. When you go across the passport office, the same thing. He makes sure to put the people in every position to do in nasty work. That's the fact. Look at what went on during the election in there. Look at everywhere, everywhere. That's what Douglas was 10 man in one. Timothy is a million. Because every department was involved in. You go across the labor department, Timothy in your way. You were the police, eh? If you didn't take the vaccine, you couldn't get promoted. But who the man says, I, who the man who agreed to that? Tim. So you got everybody in every position to make sure that he was covered. Or was he supposed to remain in the same position right now? It's impossible. They got to move out. They got to move out. Because they ain't got no respect. They definitely got to move. You got to start to show. This is not a month you're going into. You can't got to start to shuffle. Yeah. The boy, the one charge, and him, and want to see him no more. There's a group of them need to go. Them, the terrorists, us, um, terrorists us for the past couple of years. Because we're singing Timothy praises. I got a picture with Abdul Samuel when John L. win an election. In the back, praising with the Spanish flag. Are we still in charge of Nemo? The man had a sick, but you always think people are backward, some of us. The man ain't got a Spanish flag here. Yeah? In the picture, John L., the man ain't got a Spanish flag. But we didn't know we had a Spanish election. He was working with John L. I remember outside the electoral office with the placard, two Spanish people come over come to the last, asking who is John L. I got to show them the picture. The one where you have is better than look at the word. Samuel Samuel and all was fully involved in what was going on. And after the election, he celebrated with a Spanish flag. I understand what I'm saying? Hey! I understand what I'm telling all your people? I've been Samuel supposed to go on. Because he was one doing a lot of Timothy nasty work, all of them. Locking us down. Them man was over the Marriott. Who would stay out? They do everything in the power. Remember Obi said this last election, you know? The plane stuck on the tarmac and this and that. You know, really let the plane would have come in. And you were pushing the agenda. Pushing the agenda. Pushing the agenda. Because you never think the plane would have come in. And when the plane land, Obi was very instrumental. Everton Elliott was very instrumental in the Timothy walk. As we said, he was walking. And everything wanted bad. He defend. How a man could be so wicked to his country and his people? Obi them is sell out. How a man could be so wicked to the country and his people when he see people being oppressed? Oh, because he had to come on Facebook where he put in about victimization. 
when Timothy took me idea what it was. When he said to that, I couldn't get back me in the airport to get a job. He my left TDC, what it was. So Jew, get up. We need to get rid of some of these people fast. Weed them out. Like everybody's supposed to eat. I said that before. But not when they in the disrespect him. He need to be weed out. Or he never once worked for government. Or for three years couldn't call in on the radio. But weeks, Yahoo, weeks, day man, weeks, working for government could be putting up things on Facebook. Disrespecting Marcella and still on the job. I do something with weeks. Come choose the morning, yeah, Wednesday morning. If they can't find nobody, it's better. So Marcella ain't nobody. Marcella ain't nobody. Master play with these people. The National Bank Bush need to break up. I want to see Wally Wilkins them home. Off the board. And all the other boards need to mash up right now. With immediate effect. Wally Wilkins ain't gonna call blind woman another month pay. Them they're nasty. I know some big people in labor is a friend. I'm afraid to call them out when not me. Me and the friend. And if it was the friend, if it's wrong, they're wrong. So choose some of them people in the ear telling about leave people a while they will kiss them like, hey, get the rid of them. Get the rid of them. I'm a labor. But I don't know what I got to do. You need to go. You want to see why the Wilkins them on the board. They shouldn't collect a cent more to this country. And now we got people is their big friend. But I mean, I play this friend thing when people crucify me. I mean, people. Because some people seem like they're only good for labor people. Man collecting big stinking money. Nobody was talking about that. But everybody wanted to rush. So, Joe, let's get this thing organized. Let's go. Let's get mobile independence done. When independence finish, we start to mobile. We start to rumble. They got man working in tight top position. I never work in a tight top position in this country. Man, I work national security here. Yeah? And support that me already get tech way. Who wasn't working national security, who was working for TDC, and he was a car at the age of every day. I'm rejoicing that me already, me airport already get tech way. But still want to drive up and in the government here half the time and half anything. And still ain't got respect for people in the bank and half anything losing people. But that need to stop, Joe. Your people crying out, you gotta listen to the cry. Your people crying before election to get rid of them. Well, follow the goal. The whole car is getting rid of them. Especially them who in top, tight position. Trust nobody. Trust nobody, Joe. Not trust them. Because they sit down there and was a part of the crucifying of people. We live in the village, right up here. I could never forget when they detected me ID. We say how quick you can put drugs in the Prime Minister bag. Now forget that boy. Me? How I could get drugs in the Timothy bag? How the first thing, how I get the drugs in the bag? Because every time I go to a, a thing, they search me. Me like patches, breach security. Me like patches at all. Who breach international security. That was his words. Because he never believed the government would have changed. Now today, look where we be. Look where we be today. Hmm? Look where we at. Look where we at. No, Massive all of a sudden now. And Silvino, that Chu is the Prime Minister for everybody. 
But before, Tim was the Prime Minister for Unity. Just spam people. <coughs> and, and Unity people. People pay attention. It's just the focus. They got the Queen funeral going on in England. Timothy Harris was the first person to send sympathy to the family. I thought he got in England. When Mark Brown sent him to England, Mark ain't supposed to be the leader of the opposition. He, Tim should go represent the, 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 the opposition. Mark need to send him. And if he send him, he's going to go. Come on, Mark, send Timothy Harris to London as the leader, the, you're the leader of the opposition. Then you represent that, you. Douglas is going to represent the government. See, I'm Douglas is going to England. Got to catch you with money. And how kind of story I had? We sell Tim, go. Tim, the Mark send you. A OB. Do a go fund, no I call it, for Tim, so he could go on the flight. We'll catch the flight tomorrow, we'll go to Tigo. We'll up in time Monday morning for the funeral. I could have gone tonight. These are the kind of foolishness I've been doing for years. Papi show in I7, Papi show in the country. Douglas can go to England. He leave money, some money story. But they show Douglas anyway to England tonight, going into tomorrow. His team could go. Or his team in gone. Okay. Stop making mock your people. Stop making mock your people. It's a learning curve for people. Today you're up here, tomorrow you're down there. Are the same today, you're up here the same today. Got Timothy Lowe's, the same day. Close the getting night, you know. Because he never believed you could have got them next. Weeks now believe that you're the girl mix. Massive never believe that you're the girl mix because they always the girl. Josephine Huggins and all of them used to disrespect people. Didn't believe that they were the girl and blood. So this is a learning curve for my people. All I'm saying, my people, let us pay attention. Let us support the party. Let us support the, the young, vibrant labor people we have who is leading us at the moment. Very nice team. I love the team. I love the team. But we have to have a little patient, people. Some of your people who saying, oh, you can't get to see the Prime Minister, that's very real, people. Seeing Joe is not going to be the norm anymore. And we expect that. But what you could do is make an appointment. Appointment is there for everybody to make people. Go down to government headquarters and make an appointment. When you finish making your appointment, wherever constituency you live in, go to when he got his meeting, find out when he got his constituency meeting, or make an appointment at your constituency office. Everybody can't go stop going go with the quarters. How oh, 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 I expect that gonna happen? He's the Prime Minister for everybody. As I said. He's the Prime Minister for everybody. So everybody now wouldn't want to see him. That is the facts. You see him used to say, oh well, he, the monkey people say, well, he, 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 he's the constituency we have No, he changed. He's the Prime Minister now for every single body in the Federation. So everybody gonna want to see him now, you? They have to do people. Stop out of yourself. Oh, why I can't see the man and I stop out of Go down to government headquarters, make find out when it's open for an appointment to see the man. And if you live in Old Road, find out when Samal got the constituency meeting and go. If you live in Deerbe, if you live in St. Paul, where we find out and Dougie got a meeting and go. But everybody wants to go to the man in office. Oh, go make an appointment by the office. I want to see God, God, God over in him. But I'm waiting to make my appointment to see him in the office. So where we are, he'll be a friend and I'm going to make an appointment. 
Just look what I did when they wanted to see Joe. We gotta understand how things work, man. We gotta be a little bit more understandable. You know, he said, oh, we can't see Drew, we can't. But we know we see Timothy at all, at all, at all, at all. You know how long I was trying to make an appointment to see Tim? I even said to him, okay, Tim, if you want to see me, see the two ladies, see the ladies from Rams, see Danny Rollins, see Gwen, see these people then. Not a time Timothy look at me, us. Not the time we get a chance. Jack to do come in power, and in less than the time, I get a chance to meet him. I go up in the same office. I am in Douglas with the power, and there is the moose in either. Never go up in the office like that. So all I'm saying, my people, stop complaining that you can't see Joe. We got to face the reality, he's no longer the same Joe. We used to go up by Joe Lemon and drink, he ain't going to be the same. But the difference with Joe, we never see Tim. You see Joe in the front of the other at your dot. You see Marshall, Marshall lifting the car from behind Joe. You think you see Joe, when the age is buried, you think you see Joe, Timothy in the cemetery? The age is a labor. When Akilo, grandmother bury, you think Tim comes cemetery? They must have shame you walk out of the church. And when you're in the cemetery, you see Douglas giving a kilo. A sympathy card. You think Tim gonna do these things? You think Tim gonna play them kind of game? Drew's a different person, so we gotta understand that. You know the person Drew be. Everybody know who Drew is. Everybody know Drew don't know. The man is Drew's a simple guy. So we're only, oh, we get the car, get caught up in chatting, shipping. Oh, I can't get to see the prime minister now. I can't. Come on, people. You can't be the same. You was dumb. You end up dumb in Judy function the other night. Sugar Bowl calling him. Huh? Well, we need them to use the call him. Look at that. As Sugar Bowl the mocking Tim playing this song, he said he's the biggest supporter of freedom. Sugar Bowl said, Where Tim be then? If he's the biggest supporter, he's supposed to be at the function. But Tim ain't gonna go. And then play the other one, you tell people. What? Say one is what? Yeah. Yeah, son, what in hand? No. So yeah. Everybody know who we know who Joe be. But Joe don't have any control over himself anymore like that. They got to get at him. So it's not. You understand? You will see my thing, you go and talk to him. But it's not like the same old Jew that you're going to walk on the road or something. Which he, he would like to, but the system changed. There's rules to deal with the Prime Minister. So some of us just have to have a little patience, especially when we labor people. We labor people, we know how labor operates. Jew is not the type of person who run nobody. That's not Jew's style. We got to act that we know. We know we, we know we people. We know we labor people. So when someone was behaving in this way, some of them don't wonder what we really dealing with. <laughs> they saying that there's time that we ain't gonna get a kind of how, and that is that is reality. But we know the man just getting power. We know the lot of things what me happening. Everybody wanna see him. You can get investors and all want to see the man because he's a big man on the scene, a proper man on the scene. Somebody who they could trust, somebody who they feel comfortable with. Now they will, but yeah, the getty weed and the real vagabond. So we gotta just cool. We got a call. We can't let Everton Elliot them who was fighting hard against labor in every means necessary. No all of a sudden some also listen to him. No. We can't do that, labor people. Let us stay focused. Let us stay focused. We want to see Dr. Joe. Just go down to government headquarters. Tell the lady good day, you will like to make an appointment. You can go to the book, some man call upstairs, you make your appointment and your date. Just a little nice and you go see the man. If you live in St. Paul's, it's easy to see Douglas because he don't got constituency meeting where you got people to see. We live in the village. 
If you want to go in the art canvas office, you make the same, you make an appointment down by your office. Ah, just go over by the constituency, because you got a woman out of the office open right now. Just go over there and make an appointment. If not, when he got constituency meeting, when I go in the meeting, find out when is the meeting, all of them are going to meet nothing once a month away. So we got to focus, people. Let us the focus. We got a task at hand. It's to bring back the country, put back the country good name out there to the world. Let us focus. We got our school children who come and the children coming behind, who's paying attention. Because you could see the energy they got for these young people who are leading right now. So we just gotta step focus. Step focus, my labor people. We ain't went wrong from the start. From the beginning we start with them, fighting to get him out, fighting to do a lot of eyes to listen to us. Let us just not be in the same way. Yes, there's things you need to do, and I agree. But there's certain things we just need to be focused. Help, we need to help. It's a team we've been out. All of us now become your team. Because you can't know everything. He can can't do everything. That is why we have us. To help him. Because Timothy never used to want to listen to nobody. It was Timothy and Timothy where? That's not Joe. That's not Connor's style. That's not Marshall's style. That's not Dougie's style. That's not Jeffrey style. We have a team. And it means that they have to listen to the team and we have to listen to them. There's things that need to be done, and I agree that some of these people need to we need to start to step, do what we got to do. But at the end of the day, let us remember we is a team and we gotta help. We got to help the team. We got to help build back the country. Remember, think it's sexy. They used to say sexy with crime because labor was in power. Let us fight to bring back the team, the country. We got our children's future. We got the best team. Let us work with the team. Let us focus on bringing back the nation name. Yes, Judah might listen to us. Because they can't know it all. Because you already know I can speak when I see something wrong. But we cannot be listening to Obi. We cannot be listening to a lot of them other people. All of a sudden, all I want to tell you, victimization, listen to them on the street. Uh, Labour victimizing, the place slow. And they never said a thing like that when Doug when Tim was in power. Nobody will come and tell me get victimized. But all of a sudden, they could see the victimization. The eyes them up up now. But before, all of a sudden, they know who will. Tell me which one of them in the Labour Party 60. Tell me. Tell me which one of them in the Labour Party in big position like them that would have been. Okay. We gotta stay focused, people. We gotta stay focused. Well stay. Well stay. Yeah, so I think I said enough, my people. And it's a pleasure. Thank you guys for listening again. And Independence Day people, as I say, I think this independence is gonna be special for me. Because I remember I was tear guest. I was supposed to be locked up when they had the march in town in the, the August there. Just like after election day, I was supposed to be arrested because Akila Nisbet put me near the camp. She tell the police that I was intimidating people election day going to vote. That's how lying and wicked and bad they be. That's why she in hiding. By the way, anybody see Spurgey? Spurgeon Herbert tell him he's wanted. And nobody seen him at all. I don't know where he gone. And Akila tell her Akila Connor is looking for her. He got some eggs for her. She must check at the St. Johnson police station. Tell Akila, when I see her, come on, see her. She knows to come on before he was now. God don't sleep, my people. So people, let's just stay focused. We got a task at hand. We gotta clean up the mess, we gotta clean up the country. Let us stay focused. The man said you're gonna pay this wonderful money. Let us sit back, wait and have patience. 
I know everybody want money, but let us have some patience. It's already official that the money gonna be paid. Give the man in time. Let you do your work. I don't know some people frustrated with all these top people in position. And I, I will support all in that section. Somebody need to go. They definitely need to go. We need to weed them. Because I think I had enough. These people look at people suffering in this country and did nothing and say nothing. And I really do think that they need to roll. We need to start the roll on these people. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. When we send them open and Facebook and you know, that need to done. Big man shouldn't be driving around in the car on weekend and all this kind of thing. No, 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 no. That need to stop. I want me to vote for. Good work, but the car need, we need to get serious. And again, when you're working in sensitive area, national security with them kind of behaviors there. We are not better people working in them kind of areas there because, you know, we go. The pride. Uh, you got to respect yourself. That's all I'm asking for. The respect must be When you're working, you must have respect. When you don't work in the government, work, you could do all you want. You could say all you want. Because when I used to work for TDC, that's where my record was clean. Nobody could have said that Corpus Cook was disrespectful. We can't say that about part now. Partner is very disrespectful. Very, very, very disrespectful to people. We used to hear him on the radio. And a matter of fact, sometimes during working time, no more people said a complaint. Nothing been done. Because them, these are the kind of behavior the government then, Tim and Harris and them, used to encourage. Go back and look at some of the Facebook page. The Andrew Huey. The um, Ashton Lybird. Look at all of them. You think Timothy didn't know nothing about them? Hmm? I don't know. He must know. But what you do? Nothing. Man used to openly abuse people. And everybody know who there was. What do you think the Prime Minister did? Another thing. Because that's the, that's, that's the nature of what they seem like the driver. Disrespecting. But when you come back to them, they can't take it. They're crying foul. They're getting victimized. When election day last time, they got people on the corridor searching the drop, emptying the bag. All in Parliament, Timothy called people name. Give people letter in church on Sunday. But today, today, they are quite victimized. They better go understand and find out the word victimized come back they was ruthless they was vicious they was nasty to people how much people walk in silent how they were so fearful one of them said something partner coming home in the quarter nobody don't care to nothing because in charge you understand let us stay focused. Keep your head up. Keep hit the party. Keep the leaders. Keep our government in prayer. Help them. They're young. They mean well for the young people of tomorrow. But we gotta stay focused. We definitely need to get rid of a lot of these people. You know, anyone tell me. I definitely support that. Because that has no respect. When I, what I was saying then, you were looking at respect. These people got no respect. And on that, people have a happy independence. And I'm going to enjoy the independent like never before. People, thank you guys for listening. It was a pleasure. Night night to everybody on the live. Everybody who shared the live. I want to say thank you all for listening again. It's been a pleasure. You know, when I come, I come here with substance. You know, educating the people. You know, that's how we go. If I see something going wrong in the government, I will definitely speak on it. It's not politics. We have to learn to stop using the word politics. If there's an issue, we have to address it. We have to let them know when they're going wrong. It's not a party that's running out of control. Bracho was a person 
you could speak to him probably, as they used to say when Bracha come in he rest anything on the table check me thing not because I'm Bracha that's the kind of government we need these are the kind of respect we need when our officials going away have some respect for the workers good afternoon good day not just I'm Mr. Connors me and I or I'm this no 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 I don't like to see that let us respect the ordinary worker let us respect the ordinary worker people okay and with that my people good night love love i'm out it's a pleasure